here's a great way to get away from technique in the golf swing and stop thinking so much. There's a book called Zen Golf by Dr. Perrin. Uh, he was a te professional tennis coach and what he used to coach his pupils were when the ball, he dropped the tennis ball and when he bounced, they supposed to say bounce and then hit, bounce and then hit and the ball went over the net every time. He got them away from thinking about you know, where should I swing, get the hands doing. It's the same with the goal swing. You, if you start thinking, okay, I need to get a bit here or here or here, you ruin your swing. A girl bought, uh, a girl did a video the other month called Hop 2, maybe you've seen it. It's very funny. And I've watched it loads of times. And I know it sounds a bit strange, but since I've been putting this into my golf game, I'm absolutely ripping it. My swing rhythm looks fantastic. And this is what I do. So if you watch the video, I don't know the girl's name, but it's, watch the video. And he, she goes, you gotta give it that hock too. Yeah? So I address the golf ball, nice and relaxed. And I go, you gotta give it that hock too. Absolutely rip it down the middle now. Now, I was thinking about, you gotta give it that hock too. I didn't have time to think, oh, don't go back too flat, don't go back too steep, don't hit it left out of bounds, don't hit it right out of bounds. Try that. You don't have to use that song or that, that saying. You can, you can be one, two, or Coca-Cola, or gin, and tummy, whatever suits your rhythm, yeah? But try that. It'll get you away from thinking about too much of the technique and get you getting a great rhythm and not thinking about where the ball might go, okay? Try that. Easy peasy Japanese. Thank you.